In the previous video, we had seen how to create the Visualize in Power BI. If you have not watched that video, then click in the above link. In this video, we will discuss all the different types of Visualize in Power BI. Power BI is a powerful data visualization tool that enables businesses to make sense of their data and gain insights into their operations. Power BI offers a wide range of data visualization options that allow businesses to explore their data and communicate their findings effectively. In this video, we will discuss the different types of visualizations available in Power BI. Column Chart This chart type displays vertical bars, with the height of each bar representing the value. In x-axis, we have list of country with respective to the sales amount in y-axis. Bar chart, this chart type is similar to the column chart, but the bars are horizontal. To get the bar chart we need to click on clustered bar chart as shown in visuals. As we can see in tile bars are in horizontal. Line chart, this chart type displays a line that connects data points, showing trends over time or other continuous variables. We will click on line chart from the visual as shown and then later we will click on date of sale. As you can see the dates are added in the x-axis, with the year, quarter, months, and days. Now if you want to remove the year it will give the result according to the quarter, and if you remove the quarter it will give the result according to the months. Area chart. To add the area chart we need to click on visual as shown. This chart type is similar to the line chart, but the area below the line is filled in with color, making it useful for visualizing the magnitude of changes over time. Pie chart. To add the pie chart we need to click on visual as shown, this chart type is used to display the proportions of different categories or subcategories, with each slice of the pie representing a category. For example, we will remove the date and add country field. Now you can see country with different color. Donut chart. To add the donut chart we need to click on visual as shown, this chart type is similar to the pie chart, but with a hole in the center. It can be useful for displaying more categories in a compact space. Scatter chart. To add the scatter chart we need to click on visual as shown. This chart type displays points that represent individual data points, with the position of each point representing two or more variables. We will be covering in detail of the scatter chart in upcoming videos. Gauge chart. To add the gauge chart we need to click on visual as shown. This chart type is used to display progress towards a target or goal, with a needle pointing to the current value. Tree map. This chart type displays data in a hierarchical format, with each rectangle representing a category or subcategory, and the size of the rectangle representing the value of the category. In this example, we can see larger the area, the sales amount is largest, that it for this video in the next video, we will covering each and every chart in detail. Thanks for watching and do subscribe to our channel in order to learn data analytics.